Okay. Thank you, dear. Just gonna be probably 15 minutes. Yep, there it is. We'll do some live. Samuel Arnold. Samuel Arnold, hello. Hey, Bolton, how are ya? Chris Bolton, family friend, awesome dude. Just gonna go through some mail. Found these two things at actually Walgreens. Thought I'd bust those open. See what's in there. KC9, what's going on, Brian? So, let me move this back. Timmy Tea Time. Hey, what's up? Welcome. Hey, Boyd. Um, so, welcome, Timmy. There's some mail right now. Our normal auction day is uh, every Sunday at 3 o'clock Eastern Time. We're live for three or four hours doing auctions. Most auctions start at a buck. Shipping's a flat four bucks. So if you have time on Sunday, stop by and say hi. Not, not uh, We call it a no purchase necessary channel. So you can just hang out and have fun in the chat. We don't uh, mind. Well, actually, we, we encourage people to be in our chat. And if you want to buy a few things, great. Uh, Gate City. Yeah, those are from Def. So... Yeah, let's go through here. So Deafness had an auction, I think it was two weeks ago. Got a couple things. So he had a Tatis uh, lot. So we got his Optic El Nino Yellow Parallel. That Mythical is nice from Optic this year. I like the Mythical. Uh, his Gold Cup car from Topps Chrome. Red, White, and Blue from Prism. His Mini from Heritage. And then Henry bought this for me. I stepped out when this came available the nugget slot so we have a rookie card of bull bull his cards have taken off jamal murray he's trying to get his act together and another card of jamal murray so thanks to henry's desert deals appreciate that henry very nice of you but yeah some nice tatis I've, I've run out of tatis cards i wish i never would have got rid of that uh his rookie card that that one that's a landscape that's god that thing's going for 40 50 bucks crazy and then, uh, Chris, what do you think of the new, new layout here? Ashlyn, I've uh, been working hard on it. Yeah, he is. Hey, Superman, what's up? DC3, what's up? Hey, welcome, welcome. Just going through some mail today. Getting ready for our auction on Sunday. So, Deafness always throws extras. And uh, I always do the same for him and all you guys. Nice Crusade. It's one of my favorite cards is Crusade. Doll rookie card, nice. A uh, copper all star, Nolan Arenado, very nice. Trevor Story franchise features, numbered. That's a 99 of 999, lots of nines there. And on the back, there's my boy Bobachette, that's cool. Well, that's kind of cool. Uh, Charlie Blackman numbered, uh, looks like a 41 of 314. He, uh, his cards were going crazy and then he cooled off a bit, so I don't know if they're still going crazy. Uh, Sam Hilliard, the two, 100 emoji, 2 of 100. And then a Jerry Judy, new Bronco rookie card. Nice. Another rated rookie, very nice. And LaVisca Chenault from Colorado University, he is a Jag now. Very nice, blue and a red. And then a Chronicles. So thanks to Deafness for all those extras, you're the best. Um, and then he sent some extra packs, which I might just do giveaways for these on Sunday. Unless you guys want me to rip them. I really, uh, I don't get into WCW that much. Hey, AB, what's up? Oh, thank you. Yeah, Ashlyn did a great job. Hey, Texas card collector. Titan signed. I did see the Titan sign, uh, Trevor Simeon. He's a good backup guy, so uh, I'm happy to see that. Yeah, I may just have these as giveaways on Sunday. Unless you guys want to see one ripped. Yeah, I got some. I probably has some Simeon cards if you want some of those. I don't know how if he's going to stick or anything to the, um, you know, get, it, get a job. But WCW, rip it. We'll rip one. Hey, how about that? And then we'll get, save the other one for Sunday. Let's see, 91. So this is all the ones we watched, huh? World Championship Wrestling. Terry Taylor. 
What's that? Free birds? Um, nah. No? Okay. Fabulous Freebirds. Remember them? It looks like, uh, uh, who's that? Uh, oh, darn. He was a heavyweight champ. Can't think of his name. Dusty Rhodes. Looks like Dusty Rhodes. Mr. Wall Street. Alex Luger. That guy was a beast. Now, if you see pictures of him, he's like, he's still like really in shape, but his muscles will look weird and looks like he had some kind of like surgery on his, one of his biceps. Uh, Steiner Brothers, they were famous. There's a guy, there's my favorite, Sting. For sure, Sting was uh, my favorite. Hey, Plow, going through some mail. Haven't got to yours yet here. Getting to that in the next. There's, uh, woo, Ric Flair, Southern Boys, Sid Vicious. That guy was just like his name, Vicious. There's another Ric Flair, Southern Boys again. Misty Hyatt. I don't remember her. But yeah, back then I used to watch WCW. It was on Atlanta Channel, wasn't it? Atlanta. Hotlanta. Alright, uh, so Chris Plow. His Chris Plowman. His uh, auctions. And I already took them out of the cardboard so they're ready to go. Um, his auctions are Monday nights starting at 6 Mountain Time, I believe. At the crits. Uh, you can put in your info in the in the chat and uh, put your put your link in the chat too for YouTube. But most of uh, Chris's auctions start around a buck. If there's something a little more, he'll tell you if it's not starting at a buck. Uh, let's see what we got here. So lots of bows it looks like. I think probably he threw some extras in. I got this one. This was a Yankee Stadium Legacy, 1923 to 2008. It's authentic memorabilia. Uh, See the trading card game used MLB memorabilia, been used by in an official Major League Baseball game, and like Plow said that night, it doesn't say who used it, but it was from Yankee Stadium, and there was two of them, so kind of cool. One's a bat relic, one's a jersey relic. I've never seen those, so my Yankee fans will probably be, I'll probably forward those on to my Yankee fans. Pretty neat. And then, let's see, what else did I get? Looks like I got some autos. Mama Sue's in the house. <laughs> Shack Rat's here. Hey, Shack Rat Cornette, what's up? How you been? Haven't seen you in a while. Hope things are well. Uh, Akeem Victor. Oh, this is a little Broncos lot. David Woodward, we're hoping he's going to be a good linebacker. And this is a 2020. It's one of their draft picks. And then a Shannon Sharp. And this is a early card because he wore an 81 when he was a rookie. So it's like, I think it's his rookie card, actually. So nice cards. And then he put out some, there you go, Plow. 430 Pacific Standard, there you go. So check out Plow, guys. Uh, these are also from his auction, some nice Bichette cards. And then Emmanuel Sanders' disco card, very nice. Von Miller. John Elway, Super Bowl, two-time Super Bowl champ. Uh, vintage. Haven't had that. Don't have that card. That's awesome. Bradley Chubb rookie card, and then Cortland Sutton rookie card. Phoenix. I don't think I have that one actually. Platinum Von Miller. Very nice. John Elway pinnacle from '93, and a Wes Welker tops platinum. Very cool. And Plow. Uh, Plow will have certain cards he puts up for auction, but he also takes requests, a lot like we do. So if you have a team or player in mind, if he has it, he'll put it out for you. Uh, some more Boba Shets. Um, this one is Bowman Trending. Bowman Chrome. Bowman Chrome. Peaks of Potential. That's cool. I don't have that one yet. And then Ready for the Show. Nice, nice. I like my Boba Shet. I like to collect him and his dad, Dante. I've always collected Dante, so I thought it'd be cool to collect his son, too. Got one auto. That was from Chris Bolton. Very kind friend. He sent me a quad relic of Bo Bichette and Otto. Awesome card. There's a Bowman Chrome of Bichette. These are early. These are 2017. And there's a Bowman Paper, also 2017. Another Jerry Judy rookie card. Nice. And round numbers, 8 of 25, short print. Carlos Henderson and Taewon Taylor. Round 3, very nice. Thanks to Chris Plow. I'm sure several of those he just threw in because he's a nice guy. So thank you, Chris. Please check out his uh, auctions on Monday night. 
Uh, we're getting there. We're getting more people in his. We'd like to get, you know, several more in his auction. Um, he's got some good stuff, guys. So check out Chris Plow. Chris Plowman. He used to be called uh, Popeye Plow was his name. And uh, him and his wife own Cadority Cards. And they, uh, it's a program. They get uh, give cards to kids that can't afford them. Um, and I don't know a lot about it, but they're always taking donations. So, um, yeah, check out Chris Plowman and his wife, Cadority Cards. Next one is Chasing Hits. Jason, he has an auction a couple times a week. And he usually doesn't, he, it doesn't have an auction. He usually puts prices on everything. So there's a, Bra a Braden Shoemaker of the Braves, Leaf Valiant. And this one's a short print at 10 of 15. That one's a cool one. And then uh, Patrick Wisdom on card, rookie card. Price on that the guns. He's a Cardinals guy. And then Glenn Allen Hill Jr., Flash. Not sure who he's on. That's at 10 of 15, also short print. And then he put in a Noah Fant relic. Noah Fant's my guy. He's the main Bronco I collect. Uh, Zach Grenit, numbered card for deafness, 19 of 25. Uh, I got that for deaf. Oh, let's see if I can find a top loader. So deafness, if you're out there, this one's for you. Very nice. And then he threw in some Drew Locke cards. Next level, Sage Hit, uh, Premier Draft, Drew Locks, very nice, thank you sir, appreciate those, and then he also threw in a Noah Fant score, this year's score, red, red parallel, red foil, very cool, so that was from Chasing Hits, Jason, appreciate you sending those extras, much appreciated, and then what I also got in the mail was, uh, I put it in a one touch, um, I like these leaf metal drafts and the valiance and everything. So no fan. This one's out of five of ten. And I got this one for eight bucks, believe it or not. I can't believe I usually these run about twenty, twenty-five, thirty. And I just got lucky. I got it for like eight bucks. So five of ten. So I've got three or four others of this pink, which is nice. And then also in the lot came this. Rookie card select. This is the concourse level, whatever that means. <laughs> you know, they have premier level and concourse and field level, I think. And then a Prism Noah Fant rookie card. Very nice. And then I also got a good deal on this. Uh, this is a 61 and 99 Origins Noah Fant. Uh, it's a near mint to mint 8.5 Jumbo Patch Auto Red. So it's a sticker auto, but it was I got it for ten bucks on eBay. I couldn't believe it. So good deal on that. You know I like my Noah Fant, so that'll go on the PC. Um, so that is all the mail I received in the last week. Um, I did find two of these, which we'll open them up and see what we got uh, from Topps Chrome. Found these at Walmart or uh, uh, Walgreens. So we'll open these and see what's in them. Yeah, not, not too bad looking cards of Fant. I haven't been spending a whole lot on cards, but if I find a decent deal, I'll jump on it. Because I like my Fant. Uh, okay, had to put it on pause because the wife's been saying, okay, good enough, Chris. Uh, let's see. I'm going to catch up on chat real quick. Thank you, Cornette. Appreciate that comment. Haven't done anything for Kodori. Got that. I don't know what to do with him. Chris Plowman. Yeah, Boyd, I heard you were. Or Void, I heard you're like Tedster. Hello, how are you? Um, Void, I heard you're giving up on card collecting and you're just get, getting rid of your cards or something. So uh, I hope not. But I, I heard that. I, somebody mentioned it to me or I saw it in a live chat or something but i hope you're not just giving it up but let's see what's in here so in these little packs tops chrome three tops chrome packs three pink refractor parallel cards so let's see what's in here let's just open them both up and let's see what we find do we find any fun cards maybe a robert or an alvarez or something like that so let's see i guess it's robert someone heard him on get of a uh, interview and he actually he said Robert, so it is Robert. And there's a nice uh, Conforto. That's a nice looking card. Shout out to Chris Bolton and his ace, Sheldon Noose. 
Ooh, look at that one. Die cut Ricky Henderson. Very nice. I've been packaging up all my ace cards for Chris Bolton. So that'll go to Chris Bolton. If I can get it into the sleeve. There we go. Very nice. That's a nice looking card there, Chris. That's coming your way, bud. And a nice 35th anniversary of Austin Riley. Very nice. Nice looking card. You want to sleeve these up, Ash? I think I have a few left here. I'll probably grab another thing of them. Got it? Yeah. All right. That's a good good pack to start with. I really like that one. That's cool. That's yours, Bolton, Boltonomous, as uh, Bubba would say. Bubba actually has been uh, with the company he's been working for. They opened up a, an exotic car rental, and they have you know Porsches and uh, you know nice cars, uh, Land Rovers, things like that. And um, it's not just like small you know Malibus or you know small cars. So um, he he was given part ownership of that from his boss. So just set him down, babe. Yeah. And so, yeah, he was given part ownership of that. So he's now running that. So he's pretty excited. He's working every day. Here's a nice Gratterall rookie card. Dodgers. Uh, Jose Urena. I seem to get Jose Urena in everything I open. Here's a nice Trey Mancini for Babcock. And Awesome Meadows. Very nice. Die cut or deckled edges are difficult to get graded well. To like as well sometimes boy don't forget to like thank you uh shack rat all right there's a nice nico horner that's a nice rookie card let me get that one in its sleeve right away that's one of the hot rookie cards this year nico horner very nice there's the rest of them jose ramirez uh Arraz, arena rookie card <clears throat> And a Chris Paddock, Future Stars. Very nice. Nice looking cards. Let's save the pink ones for later. Just a break. Hello, hello. What's going on? Thanks for stopping by. Just did some mail and we're just looking at some uh, of the Topps Chrome, these uh, uh, packs they have with the three or four packs in them. Uh, there's Gratterall again, rookie card. Another Jose Urena. This is almost identical to the other pack. Uh, there's Brendan Lau. Lau has been on fire. And I actually started collecting him and uh, his brother Nate Lau uh, last year. And I've got several autos. And I guess he's taken off. So that's that's a good call on collecting him last year. And then a Yelly. Shout, shout out to the Shack Rat. That's his team. That's his guy. Nice 35th anniversary. A couple more packs. And then we got the, the bonus refractor peak cards. Um, so yeah, it's crazy out there. This is identical to the last one again. Nico Horner rookie card. Jose Ramirez. Oh, that's a different one. Mike Soroka gold cup. That's a nice one. And a refractor of uh, Rezel Iglesias. That is a refractor. Nice. Very nice. Make sure none of these are refractors. You know where it says refractor? Up on the right, right hand side under the number. See it say refractor? Just make the other ones don't have it on um, the ones you just sleeved up. Just make sure none of the other ones, yeah. Make sure I didn't miss one. Mm. But that's the only refractor I've seen so far. Yeah, Yellich is your guy. Yelly is your guy. Um, so yeah, guys, I, I go in live once in a while during the week just to do mail and open some packs if I can ever find some. But every Sunday, 3 o'clock uh, Eastern is our live auction. And we'll go live three or four hours. Alex Young, Ricky Card. Manny Machado, Cabrera, and I see a little rainbow foil here. Dan Vogelbach with the Mariners. Rainbow foil. Good looking card. Very nice. And let's see what we got on the pink refractors. I'm like, why do I not have at least 10 Platinum Rookie cards in a 10? I know. Isn't that crazy? Um, yeah? Oh, Meadows is a refractor? I missed that one. Austin Meadows refractor. See, I missed that one. Nice. 
Um, yeah, I have a few Blackman rookie cards that not graded, and I couldn't believe how much they're going for. That's just nuts. So there is a nice Yaz. Mike Yastrzemski. All these will be refractors that are pink. So uh, Machado, Machado, Machado. Oh, there we go. There we go. Vladdy. Very nice. Pink refractor. I collect Vladdy to a certain extent, along with Bo, since uh, I collect his dad. Oh, there it is. Hey, Daphnis, what's up, what's up? Just got a card in I ordered for you, Def. Let's see if I can find it. Hi, Shack Rat. Shack Rat, Shack Rat. Here you go, Def. Found this for you. 19 of 25. Zach Granite with your twins. Ordered that one for you. I think I found it in uh, one of the auctions. So that one's coming your way, buddy. All right, last pack. Kikuchi and Morijan and Candelero. Candelario. So a couple of the Topps Chrome Hanger packs. Um, it's this little fat pack they have three packs and then one with three uh, pink refractors in it. I think it was 11 bucks, 12 bucks, and it was at Walgreens where I found these. I just happened to stop by there and uh, you, you guys know how it is. Uh, like Deafness was talking about in his walk just a while ago. It's it's uh, frustrating um, and I, I've been looking on Twitter a lot more and a lot of people are um, still having trouble finding finding things at retail, you know, Walmart, Target, and you see people taking pictures of lines of men waiting for these packs. And um, when I did find some last week, and you guys all know, I, you know, bought bought a lot of packs in the in the uh, parking lot of, of Walmart. Um, almost like a drug deal going on. But um, that day when I was in there, um, and I talked to the gal who was who was uh, you know whatever the name of Image Holdings or whatever it is, the company that that stocks the cards for us. Um, asked her to how, how, when do you come in? She goes, well, I don't tell people that now because you know these people just wait for me. And um, she said it's funny because as soon as she comes in, it's just like clockwork. Somebody there must you know that works there calls these guys because she said always the same faces show up. And she said I'm the first one she's seen different in, in the last two months. So um, it's frustrating. You can't even get retail anymore, and I uh, feel especially bad for the kids that can't even get a box that they want. Um, without paying two or three times, you know, what it's worth. Um, and then I also got this. We may as well open this. Um, go ahead and put that with those. This is a top heritage that uh, Alex Bernard sent me in a trade we had. I look for limited and exclusive 71 top space ball tattoos. Ooh, we could put tattoos on each other, huh? So let's see what's in here. And then, uh, yeah, they are, you know, and... Um, the guys I was in line with, they were saying, oh, I just want one box and, oh, I just want a couple boxes for me because that's my job. And, you know, that's, I sell them on eBay. I said, yeah, but you double and triple the prices, right? He's like, oh, no, I wouldn't do that. I was like, nah, I know better. <laughs> I know better, you know, but it is what it is, you know. Definitely takes the fun out of it for all of us and especially our young collectors. The only way they get cards is if, you know, some of us send some to them. All right, so this is a hanger box, um, Heritage. So I don't know what the uh, short prints numbers are. I think last year was above 300 or something like that. So anybody, anybody knows that? Oh, are we, are we frozen? If anybody knows that info, let me know what numbers are the short prints, what and above. Hold on, someone's texting me. All right, Asadillo, there's Mondesi, James McCann, Mustakis, Adam Eaton, Phil Irvin, Garrett Cooper, Teal Scar Hernandez, Luke Weaver, Freddie Peralta. 400 to 500 are short prints. Okay, good to know. Thank you. Uh, this is the breaks and Timmy T time. We'll look at the numbers here in a sec. Justin Epton, Eric Fetty, Ozzy Albies, there's Guzman, John Meese, All Star. Uh, Gold Cup. That's a nice looking card. I like this year's cards. I didn't like the gray so much last year, but these are nice. Austin Slater, 
Craig Kimbrell and strikeout leaders with DeGrom, Strasburg, and Scherzer. So we're looking for above 400, 400 to 500. I don't think I saw anything crazy, so we'll double check it. There's 392. How's your letter writing go? Good. Okay, none above 400 there. Couldn't find a re retail for two months straight, and I was trying to get some for my cousin. Yeah, isn't that terrible? Isn't that terrible? Truth, what's up? What's up? What's up? Um, I just saw your text, Truth. Oh, that's terrible. Yeah. Yeah, I had a couple people... Uh, juke us out of some money this year but at least i didn't send cards to him i had already uh we held them for and these two brand new people that i that we just came for the first time and uh they wouldn't respond to our emails or anything so i just put the cards back and uh that was that uh there's a yaz chris davis shout out to chris bolton sandoval kelly clint frazier flaherty for the guns Suzuki comes through with the blast. There's Chris Archer, who I guess has been a terrible pitcher since he's been traded to, uh, from the Rays to the Pirates. Mercado, Danny Jansen. There's a Twins card for deafness. Rookie stars, Lewis Thorpe. Gratterall, very nice. Rojas, Grishuk, Bedrosian, Aaron Sanchez, Tommy Pham, and Indians rookies. Shout out to uh, Terry Paul and Smash. Smash likes his Indians. So we're looking for above 400s. I don't think there is any. Uh, nope. Okay. And then there's one, what is this, sticker collection. Huh. Three sticker cards. Alrighty. David Cheney, what's up? Oh, great. So there's a little kid who walked up right after I got them and said, Mommy, there is no more again. So I went out, I went on, paid for him, then I seen the kid walking out, and I went, oh, good for you, David. That is awesome. That is awesome. Um, yeah, go drive. Oh, awesome truth. Appreciate it. Um, yeah, that day I found all that product last Friday uh, at Walmart in the parking lot. Um the first couple guys took everything that was put out. And so um, a, a kid came up and he wanted to get a box of whatever, baseball. And the guys were like, sorry. Actually, no, he wanted basketball. He wanted one of the new basketballs. And so um, uh, one of the, um, the guys uh, that I was talking to, um, I convinced them to let the kid buy one box at 20 bucks, you know, because he was still inside the store and he let them. So... That made me happy, but terrible. Terrible, we can't get kids, you know, uh, these cars. It's terrible. So these are all stickers. There's Kristen Yelich. Shout out to the Shack Rat. There's a Vladdy. These are cool. There's another Lindor for Terry Paul. Celebrate with Topps Baseball Card Day, August 8th. That's, my, that's our son's birthday. He was 18 this year. That's already done. Cool, cool. All right. So what else is going on? We got uh, who's on live tonight. We got, I think Chasing Hits Jason is live. I think he might be doing his auction right now. Eloy is live right now for his fire cells and breaks. Uh, of course, BITG is live on Fridays. Eloy is live right now. So, uh, guys, thanks for hanging out. I just want to open some mail and uh, open a couple packs. So... Uh, have a great Sunday night. Have a great weekend. We'll see you Sunday, 3 o'clock Eastern, for our normal weekly auction. Everybody's welcome. No purchase necessary. And uh, I'll try to start organizing cards now so I have some good cards to put out. So with that, take care, everybody. We love you. And uh, we'll see you soon on the next live feed. I'll, I'm going to jump over to Eloy's auction. So if you guys want to, meet me over there. Take care.